Here's all the major news you missed during the NFL offseason. There's been a lot of speculation about whether or not the 49ers and Steelers agree to trade on Brandon Ayuk, but nothing has been finalized yet. But what I can tell you is that the Steelers and 49ers are in the final stages of negotiations. Jordan Azen has just been charged with a misdemeanor DUI and could face up to a three-game suspension. And if he's convicted or pleads guilty, he could face up to six months in prison. Jalen Hurts lit up the flame at the LA Coliseum to represent that flag football is coming to the Olympics in 20. 28. Due to all the activities Hassan Reddick has missed with the Jets, he's faced up to $1 million worth of fines. John Gruden was seen back at the Chiefs training camp. When does he just become a head coach for this team? Commanders head coach Dan Quinn just announced that we will be seeing Jaden Daniels play this week. Puka Nakua is now week to week due to a knee injury he suffered over the weekend. Zadarius Smith was carted off at Brown's training camp today. Hopefully it's nothing serious and just precaution. Unfortunate news for Bengals Cam Sample as he tore his Achilles today and will miss the entire season. The Chiefs and Harrison Buckter just agreed to a new contract extension, making him the highest paid kicker in the NFL. Quandre Diggs signed a one-year deal with the Titans, reuniting with Jamal Adams. Matthew Judon stated today that he's going to be playing under his current contract this season. Tom Brady stated if the right opportunity came along that he would unretire. Bro, you're 47! FX just announced that they're going to be releasing an Aaron Hernandez show slash documentary in September.